Okay, what's going on, y'all? So there seems to be something in the water lately. That's got a lot of people, you know, judging more than usual. I'm used to people judging me, you know, because I'm just the flyest motherfucker around, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> No, you don't get okay. No, but people are starting to judge about every little thing that another person does. Now this is getting crazy, y'all. So I had to hit up one of the realest people I know, and I was like, who keeps it more real than my boy Khalil? You really like how that rhyme, right? But I'm tired of people judging. Now judging and hating has a slight difference, but it's practically the same thing. If someone's living their life, let them live their life. Your life is not their life. So why is their life important to your life? Now that their life is important to your life, the person's life that you're talking about is probably gonna make your life go night-night. You going night-night, nigga? We are not blood-related. We are not friends. We do not know each other in any way possible. So why the fuck the shit I do affects you? Why do you not like me, even though you don't know me? Am I fucking your life up in some way, shape, or form? Because if I don't, my fucking business okay look i don't smoke cigarettes or anything but if somebody smokes cigarettes you know that's their life decision and that's also their death decision because they probably gonna die but that's not the point the point is if they want to do that let them do that you can stay away from it you can still remain a healthy person you ain't gotta be like why you smoking cigarettes that ain't even cute you know what that does to your lungs ain't you seen those truth commercials <laughs> Bitch, I've done seen the truth commercials and the truth is if you don't get out of my motherfucking face I'm gonna blow this smoke in your face and I'm gonna put the cigarette out in your motherfucking eyeball Shit's gonna get real The thing is, you never know where somebody is in life You don't know the position or what's happening The way they dress could be because of religion, money issues, or even because they family The way they act could be because of family issues or past experiences We need to stop judging and worry about ourselves Are you staying focused? Are you making that money? Are you not being a hoe? Cause that's what really matters Look ladies, if the girl in your class is a slut bag and is sleeping with all these dudes, getting all these STDs, that's her problem. And she's the one that has to go home and sleep with bumps on her coochie. You know, she's just scratching her. I wasn't there yesterday. Like, that ain't your problem, you know what I'm saying? You could tell her, look, I don't think you're making right choices in life. Do you want to end up with HIV, AIDS, chlamydia, all these diseases that could potentially ruin your life? And my philosophy is if another dude is judging another dude, well, first of all, that's kind of suspect, but in reality, it all comes from insecurities from within. Now, I understand that everyone deals with insecurities here and there, but there's different ways you can handle them, people. Like, dude, no homo, but I understand. Like, you probably got a small penis. And it's hard, you know, to deal with a small penis. I mean, I can't really relate, but... I can imagine. Pause. Nah, but look, just because you ain't got something that somebody else got doesn't mean that you gotta bring them down. Exactly. Jealousy is just too ugly of a trait. And if somebody has something you don't have, then honestly, you need to work your ass to get what they have. Don't try and bring them down because bringing them down is just wasting your time. The time that you spend hating on them, you can spend grinding and trying to get further and get where you wanna be and what you want. Sure, they might've got it easy or got it faster than you, but that's no need to hate. Cause when you get it, that work that you put in is gonna feel so good and you're gonna feel like you can do anything. Who that bitch? She knew? Who the fuck she thinks she is with that wave trying to look like me and Shad? Oh, that's her boyfriend? He ugly. Oh, hell no, Franquisha. This bitch came in, got an A on her test and shit, bitch. Why this bitch got better grades than me, though? I was like, bitch, what you trying to do? Look smarter than me, bitch? That's what the new girl did today, bitch. Decided to trip in front of the hallway. Everybody in the hall was like, a oh, hardy, hard, hard. Like, what the fuck is so funny? What's so funny? She fell. So what? So what? What the fuck? I was like, bitch, what you trying to be? Funnier than me? You think you funnier than me? You think you funnier than me, bitch? You think you funnier than me? Like, I swear to God, she trying to take away my shine. She trying to take away my shine. It's like, no matter what that person do, negative or positive, yo ass jealous of them. For no damn reason. You ever seen a rich hater? You know what I'm saying? Someone that just like, hating on this motherfucker because he is so successful. He's driving a Lamborghini. He's got money, car, clothes, hoes, all that. Living the life. And you over here more bitter than a world star hater. Look, my thing is, everyone can get their own. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no reason to judge other people. Let other people live their life. Some people in life are gay. Some people are lesbian. Some people are straight. Some people are bi. Sexual. Let their sexuality be their sexuality. There ain't no reason to be like, oh, why you doing that? I don't believe in that. You going to hell. Because first of all, whatever their sexuality is, it's not like they attracted to you. It's not like they like, hey, you want to come into the bedroom with us and get it in? Like unless they invited you to an orgy or videotaped it and mailed it to your home address, there ain't no reason to be tripping. Everyone that is judging everyone else, there's only one person that you need to judge, and that's that motherfucker in the mirror. Yo, shout out to my boy Khalil. Appreciate you doing this video. As always, make sure to you know check out his channel subscribe hilarious videos and uh yeah if you haven't already join the team team mystic we're the best team in the league mystic got jokes bitch
beautiful. Let it be beautiful. Let it be beautiful.